guys my name is Damien Foster and welcome back to my channel if you're new welcome to the family please click the like and subscribe button below for future content in my life in China so I am going to one of the co well I think it is the coldest uh, city in China and the city is Harbin so I am actually gonna run I'm running a little bit late um the taxi is coming for me and then it's going to pick up my other friend and then we're gonna head to the Pudong Airport in Shanghai and then we're gonna head off from Shanghai to Harbin so what I have now is I have my luggage this is what I have here so far um, this is my first this is my first time actually traveling to a very cold city or even packing for winter so I had to do a lot of research I had to go on YouTube and other things like that so I hope I packed everything I needed um, so I'm very excited guys so let's go to Harbin let's go girl get in this car let's go Guys, let me tell you how I think we overdressed going to this trip. I am wet, I'm sweating, I'm wearing boots. The back of my neck is wet. He's wearing Yeezys. <laughs> I'm wearing Yeezys. The Chinese version of Yeezys. This Eskimo here is wearing... And I'm gonna be walking on snow, guys. Like... In our defense, we wanted to wear the heaviest things so that our suitcase wouldn't be too heavy. So this is us packing up everything that would have taken too much space. So Ugh. we're not completely idiots, okay? This is a well thought plan. It just looks bad. I'm so hot, guys. <laughs> Like, what was your experience when you first came to China? Let me tell you guys. So, <laughs> I got on the plane back home and I was sitting between this, I think they're friends or something. And the seat, I think two seats down, there was this hot guy. Like, that oh guy my was God. a fucking flame. And that time, my skin was a mess. I had acne. I was like, no, no. But anyway, Listen, delays, delays for one. I was just running around, but when I finally, when I finally got to the airport here in Shanghai, I didn't know where I was going. I didn't know where I was supposed to go. I was so confused, and I came alone. Mm. But my key thing is go with the masses. I just followed everybody. <laughs> People were just. I was like, okay. And then before I knew it, I was out. I was like, oh, okay. So I still don't know how I got around. I still don't know how to get around. Mm. But I'll always follow the people. For the people so my experience when i first came to china was it was crazy i had no idea what i was doing there were so many applications to fill out and Ooh, yes. that, that right there was the craziest part and verifying that you are who you say you are your picture with your passport I mean scan your face and everything so i had to fly from the bahamas to new york from new york to shanghai and then from shanghai to my first city nanchang when I came to Ooh. Shanghai, Shanghai is a big airport. So I'm thinking, yes. okay, when I get there, I just go to the terminal. Come to find out that I had to go on a train to my terminal. I thought I arrived. I didn't arrive. I had to go outside down to catch a bus with a million, millions of people, millions of people. And then from the bus, they took me to the terminal. So that's basically Actually, my, my experience there. The it's Shanghai airport is nothing to... Hong Kong. You've been to Hong Kong? Because I, I that's where I that's where I had to switch. Uh, 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 uh. When I got to Hong Kong, I was like, what in the world? What is this massive thing? It, it's huge, but it's Ooh. fucking huge. Same thing there, you take trains to go to your next place. It it mm. was a mess. But Hong Kong is beautiful, like the airport is beautiful. Mm. And it's more international obviously, so there's English everywhere. You can kind of figure it out if you just read. Mm, mm. But yeah, Hong Kong is massive. We're gonna explore Tinder in Harbin, guys. Okay, we're gonna I'm not putting it on. <laughs> Listen, okay, I'm gonna explore. I'm Tinder, not doing. I don't do okay? that. I don't do that. I'm gonna things. see what Harbin has to offer, and I'll tell you guys. I will tell you if the Harbin <laughs> men are giving. Okay, I got you. I got your back. 
Okay, so BC, someone's gonna be swiping it up and harping. Swipe, 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 swipe. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, we gotta go. Bye bye. Bye guys, see you later. <laughs>so we finally left the airport and we decided to go with the shuttle bus just to cut some cost okay guys so we're off the shuttle bus and now we still have some ways to go so we're gonna walk and we're gonna try to find the hotel that we're going to Tati did you find the hotel yeah but it's kind of nice there's a lot of traffic there this is gonna be Honest, part, is that your mask? <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I thought the weather in Harbin would be like extremely, extremely cold. I don't know why, but it's not. It's definitely not as cold um, as I as as I had expected to be. Um, but anyway, be careful what you wish for, right? Anyway, so let's go and find this hotel. Finally here at the Fairfield by Merritt Hotel in Harbin and now we're gonna check first now we're gonna check in and get settled in and then we're gonna meet our friends later. getting some rest from the long trip to Harbin we are going to meet our friends for dinner are you ready for dinner I actually I'm not hungry she's not hungry because someone ordered burrito and all kind of crap but she could have just waited for dinner it's not a burrito it's like a, <laughs> a chinito, <laughs> chinito. <laughs> I don't mean can we just say like what's this girl wearing this it's a heater but I mean it's 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 cold outside Listen. It ain't been cold since we fucking <laughs> lit the damn airport. I mean, <laughs> so we'll see you guys when we get there. I was really gonna some frostbite then. You want some frostbites? Mm -hmm.
How is it? Good. Mm. It's ours, ours. We ordered too, remember? Yo! <laughs> it's so good. Yes. It looks like the same I ordered on mine. Mm. So good. Yeah. This Russian, this Russian honey cake is delicious. What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing. It's really good. <laughs> Oh, you want to recover? Oh, so hey guys, so we just finished eating at a westernized slash Russian restaurant, and let me tell you, the food was lit. My favorite dish was the beef. Was it beef brush? Yes, beef brush. The the soup was lit, and one other thing I liked was the what's it called? Did you like the service? <laughs> let me tell you guys what happened. Let me tell you guys what happened. When someone do a tantrum in the restaurant, <laughs> the food was good. Over, I really loved it. Vodka, vodka, but the uh, hello. Say hello. I want you to say hello to my vlog. Say hello, hello. Welcome to Harbin. Welcome, welcome. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I'm happy to be here. Yes. Nikwe, Nikwe is showing, Mama. What book is for you? What book is for you? Russian. You are oh, Russian. Russian? Yes, you can speak Russian. She's Russian. Say yes. hello in Russian. Yes. Can you say hello? Yes. Follow me. Da da da. Привет. Привет. Добро пожаловать в Харбин, Туриста. Wow. Уважаемый Харбин. Спасибо. Пожалуйста. Wow. Wow. He can he can speak Russian really well. Very good. Very good. Wow. Bye bye. Not that cold. Okay, come with your summer stuff. Ooh, so yeah. It wasn't that cold, but this weekend is going to be like negative twenty-four. Look how what is good is when in Harbin, it but it's, it it's not. It's really not that cold. Like it's, it's basically like slightly chilly. But yeah, yeah. But the weekend. <laughs> listen, stay tuned because wait until the weekend. It's going to be like negative twenty-three on the weekend. <laughs> Yo guys, so it's 6 in the morning and even though you're on vacation, you should always still go to the gym. So we're going to the gym. Why you look so sad? You're supposed to be excited. I'm not Why? excited about going to fucking gym. Why are you not excited? At fucking 6 in the morning? This guy's making me do this, guys. I don't know. You're blaming me? Listen, health is very important, okay? Self-love is very important. Making friends who let you just not go to gym is also... So we're, she's gonna appreciate this later when, when summertime comes and she's like, Damon, you was right. My body is right for the summer. Yeah. Okay guys, so I'm done with the gym. I had a good workout. I think I worked out for like two hours. 
Um, so I'm gonna head back and get ready, take a shower, and then we're going to breakfast. And after breakfast, we're going to meet up. Everyone's gonna meet up, and then we're gonna go to, I don't know where we're going yet, but I'll keep you posted. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna head back and get freshened up, get some breakfast, and let's go. Okay guys, if you've watched this far, please don't forget to click the like and subscribe button below for future content and following my journey of living in China. Okay guys, so our first stop for today is the Sun Island. So we're at Sun Island right now and we're still waiting for our other colleagues to come. Let me tell you guys, honestly, this one was like, oh, it's not cold, it's not cold. It's freaking cold, bruh. Guys, it's lit. Today. It's freaking lit. <laughs> oh, my thing's getting warm. All my fingers are... No, but you know what guys i'm doing this for you i am doing this for you guys i'm going to vlog i'm going to do as best as i can in this cold weather to show you guys the beautiful city of harbor oh it is warm so why isn't this why is it getting warm anyway so let's go inside sun island let's go. Once a day that I would pray for you I'd go and misbehave just so you'd notice too Sneaking looks up and down from across the room and Damn, what a hell of a view I feel good, you look great I like you, I can't wait A first time, a first day You're so fine, I'm so late You sip wine, I drink straight Don't waste time to my place I feel my heart erase So catch me if I fall Thanks to my guy here, Roman, for recording. Shout out to Roman. Welcome, 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 welcome. Yeah. You're so fine, I'm so late. You sip wine, I drink straight. Don't waste time to my place. I feel my heart erase. So catch me if I fall. How was it? Good. <laughs> Anna, how was it? <laughs> oh, 
next activity we're going to do together and it's gonna be eight of us, so I so are you guys ready? When I say are you ready, we say let's go, okay? Yeah. Are you ready? Let's go! We it, get me a street cook and catch me when I'm falling. Cover up my scars, flip the handlebars, crash it in my car, wake up in a bar, I'll be a superstar, just on my avatar. This world is so bizarre, empty out the reservoir. Yeah. Yeah, straight to the face And I wanna get lost I'm sick of this place Don't know how to stop When I'm feeling this way So I'm taking six shots Till I'm feeling okay I think I'm going crazy Don't think I'll get on safe So I'm taking six shots All straight to the face I'm taking six shots Are you coming with me? I'm taking six shots Yeah, straight to the face And I wanna get lost I'm sick of this place Don't know how to stop Honestly guys, my experience in Harbin so far has been amazing. One of the things I would say is, please make sure you're warm. I have an, I, I have an inner vest that it's a heater. That's one of the most important things. Another important thing is making sure your hands, your hands are warm. Double up on, double up on gloves. I would recommend that. So guys, we are finally done with the activities at Sun Island in Harbin. And now we're going to the, what's the name of the place? Oh, okay. If you have watched this far and you, you like what you see, please click the like and subscribe button below. And just so that my video can reach a wider audience. at sun island they have this nice zoo type thing where you can feed different variety of animals they have ostrich they have foxes they have bears they have turkey they have horses so amazing so guys i want you guys to follow me and i'm going to feed i don't know what animal i want to feed i don't know what i'm thinking I'm, you know actually i think i'm going to feed the foxes i thought they were Herbivore, I mean uh, carnivores. Exactly, would you just feed them a fucking fruit? Why am I feeding foxes fruits? Because they're fucking vegan. But he ate it though. Maybe it's a vegan <laughs> fox, guys. Maybe it's a vegan fox. Never in a million years I thought that I would have seen a llama. I've, I always see them on TV. But to meet a llama in person, I'm just like, whoa, I'm really amazed by this. Wow, look at his eyes. They have beautiful eyes. Oh, this one's hungry. Oh, look at those teeth. Listen, guys, Sun Island is the place to be in Harbin. There are so many activities to do. I would highly recommend coming here with friends. It's more fun with, with friends because there are so many activities that require more than one people. So, I also want to say thank you guys for helping me to reach the 300 subscribers. Wow. Just to say thank you guys so much. It was, it was, it was I literally my Christmas present for this year. <laughs> Hey guys, so we're currently at the Snow and Ice World. We just booked our ticket, we just bought our tickets and now we're gonna go inside. So I am going to show you guys around Snow and Ice World, another uh, famous attraction in the city of Harbin. So let's go.
guys, we're finally here. We're going to see the Siberian tigers. Are you excited? Well, the thing is with her, she's from South Africa, so she's used to seeing tigers. So, how do you feel about this? I think she, you was mentioning about their, their like... So, the difference between the Siberian tigers and mm -hmm. our tigers are that Siberian tigers are just larger, but that's about it. Like, they're basically obese. That's it. Like, ugh. So, she's really excited. Listen, I'm from the <laughs> islands. We don't actually know tigers in, on the islands. We, all we know is the beach, the water, the fish. sand, the fish, the... The crawfish and Morning. stuff like that. Anyway, hey Roman. Hey Hi. buddy. Are you excited to see the, the Siberian tigers? Of course. You're excited? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Roman, come back. If you don't know, you don't know. Good morning, Anna. Another beautiful day. Ooh. Are you excited to see the Siberian tigers? Yes. Ooh. Let's go. <laughs> feeding the tigers steak but then we realize i mean beef but we've realized that there's also an option there's an option to feed the tigers live chickens but no one wants to do it i personally um i just can't do it i don't think i would be able to do it so if you're watching first don't forget to click the like and subscribe button and also answer the question in the comment below would you feed would you feed a live chicken to the siberian tigers would you guys feed the what you doing I know what you're doing. No, no. What you doing, bro? No, 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 no. So we're going to call this. We're just going to not do this one. But we were thinking about waiting for someone to do it and then maybe take a clip. But no one wants to do it. But anyway, let's go. Let's continue. Hey, guys. So we're on our way to Sophia Church, one of, I guess, one of the biggest tourist attractions in Harbin. I honestly have no idea what to expect from it, but it's it's there. It's a church. I mean, <laughs> it's a church. <laughs> but hey, I'm here for it all. I, we want to explore it all, so we're going to check it out and stay tuned. Guys, did he tell you how cold it is today? Did you did you tell him? I mean, I don't know what it is. Did he tell you? It's that cold. We can feel our damn feet. <laughs> it's cold. I can't feel my fingers, but it's. it's it, it was not as bad as the day before. I oh, must but the say. air is much colder today. Mm. Like even when it comes to your nostrils, it's fucking. Cold. I mean, you gotta be cussing on my channel like this. I'm oh, sorry, guys. I'm the cussing friend. Like I can't, <laughs> I can't say more than word like cussing. I'm so sorry. Maybe my trip to church will <laughs> redeem. You know what? We need the, to go to Sophia Church so this one could get cleansed. Hi, <laughs> Okay, see you guys. So we're finally here at the Sophia Church in Harbin, and we're gonna go out. We're gonna go inside, and it's only 20 RMB. Um, so I'm quite excited about it. So let's go. Follow me. In Harbin right now, it's negative 18. 
Can you guys see? It's negative 18 and I'm and I'm here outside an island boy for an, an island boy from the Bahamas in Harbin in negative 18 degree weather and eating ice cream. Could you believe it? <laughs> it's crazy, right? So guys, when you visit the city of Harbin, there are many Russian restaurants. And this is the restaurant that I recommend that you come to. Nice live music. You have a violinist. You have someone playing the saxophone. And the service was amazing. The menu was amazing. Food tasted really, really good. So when you come to Harbin, you should definitely visit this restaurant. If you want more information, follow me on my Instagram. Woo! Hey guys, good morning. Um, so this is our last. This is the last stop of the trip to Harbin. Um, I'm currently at a Volga. Vol I, ho I hope I'm pronouncing it correctly, but it's called Volga Mater Park. It's a Russian influence uh, theme park. Right, not really theme park, but like more like for sightseeing and stuff like that. So I'm going to take you guys around so you can see it. Um, you know, for those who are planning to come to Harbin and want to experience um, different places, Volga Mater Park is one of the places that I would, I mean, I, I haven't seen it yet, but from the reviews that I've seen, um, from pictures and everything, but hey, I'm here now, so you guys can be the judge. Um, I'll take as many, as many uh, videos and content as I can see for you guys to see. So let's go. Come to the Volga Manor Park. You buy your tickets. You come in, and then this is this little yellow bus that I showed you guys earlier. And you get on the bus, and then they're gonna give us a tour. So, are you guys ready? Sure. I mean, are you guys tired? <laughs> you guys look so tired. It's the last day, so. Bye. <laughs> So now we're at the Poseidon Palace and we have this beautiful statue and some horses. So we're going to take some pictures and enjoy the festivities. So let's go. Guys, I deserve an award, okay? I'm an island boy. I'm from, the, I'm from the Bahamas, and I'm in this weather here. And I'm still alive. I'm still breathing. It is so cold, but I'm still here. But anyway, we're about to head to the Vodka Museum, and let's go. Okay, hey guys, so that ends. Woo, let me take off this thing here. If I can breathe. So, that ends the trip to Harvard. Woo! So, guys, listen, let me tell you. If you first of all, I would like to say thank you to Anna for planning it. Woo, the plug, guys. She is the plug. Come on, Anna. To Anna. Woo! If it wasn't for her, this would have been like this. 
<laughs> Chuck it to the head. <laughs> and Roman with the with the XL and all the techie stuff. Woo! And this one for just just running a damn mouth the whole time. <laughs> I, I, I'm joking. I'm joking. But my videographer, Guys, my videographer. Come here. Make sure to buy the vodka. It's, it's good quality. Buy the bottle, okay? The real one. Just buy it. Apparently, it's like fake vodka. I mean, things we don't know. The Russians only do these things. <laughs> no. But the vodka here is what you should be drinking. Yes. Ooh, if you want to know, yeah. If go. you want to know if your vodka is real, put it in the freezer. Apparently, real vodka doesn't freeze. Mm. There we go. So guess what guys? That concludes my vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you were there with us. If you haven't yet, you better click that like and subscribe button. Click the like and subscribe button. Share. Listen, comment below. Ah! <laughs> <I> mean, <hey. laughs> guys, bye-bye. We'll say bye-bye.